a Ramadan tradition in Algeria. During the holy month, the country's Athletics Federation holds three night meets for track and field. This year, the competition holds even more significance. The deadline for achieving World Championship times is July 23rd, and such a meet is great for players who are still seeking to qualify for London 2017. But this year, many Algerian athletes are also using this competition to prepare for upcoming tournaments, like the World Under-18 IAAF Championships to be hosted in Kenya, and the Africa Under-20 Championships expected to be hosted here in Algeria at the end of June. This event also helps raise the standards of our athletes. As far as the under-20 event goes, we are on track to host the competition. It is unfortunate that some countries will not come, but we are hoping for good results and maybe finish in the top five of the medal standings. At least 12 athletes in the country have already attained qualifying standards for the world's including 400-meter hurdles national record holder, Malek Lawulu. The 25-year-old is hopeful of a successful year, motivated by impressive results in the event by Kenyan athletes world champion Nicholas Bett and Rio silver medalist Bonfis Musheru. They gave me encouragement and uh, I feel uh, confident. So because the, this African, uh, African athlete, the, the, they, they, are, uh, they are good now in 400 meter hurdles. Uh, the gold, I don't think the gold. Uh, the, the, the truth, no. I think in the final, I will, uh, I will try to, go to, the, to get in the final. So in the best, in the eight, with the eight best athletes, so I will be happy. Former 1,500-meter Olympic champion Taufik Maklufi is another athlete the country hopes can deliver a medal in London. Algeria has a rich history in middle-distance track events, but now the country is looking to diversify its disciplines. There's a period when athletics here was at a high level. Then somewhere between the late 90s and 2010, we went through a really bad patch. In the last four years, though, we're seeing the Federation trying to fix what went wrong, which was mainly a loss in technical direction and strategy. There's also a breed of young athletes coming up in events other than track, like the pole vault, for example, and they're doing very well. Il y a des jeunes espoirs très intéressants qui sont en train de monter. At the 2015 World Championships in Beijing, Algeria was represented by 14 athletes and did not win any medals. The country hopes its upcoming talents can this time around bring home some medals from London. Celestine Karone, CGTN in Algiers, Algeria.